Hi guys, it's Jane here. David and I were just speaking today. I'm thinking how odd it is we're not putting on Strictly at this time of year. By this time, we should be in hair and makeup. We should be have had our dress rehearsal and we should be looking forward to the show. But for reasons we all know, 2020 is going to be delayed. So we thought to help us all get over our withdrawal symptoms from our Strictly, that we should put up last year's show for everybody to sit back and enjoy. Team 2020 are waiting in the wings. This is what we're going to be doing. So we're all looking forward to getting back into rehearsal and being able to put on a really good show again for Dunbar Lifeboats. Thanks to everybody so far, and I'll see you soon. Bye. <laughs> I'd like to welcome you all to this, our first Strictly for the Lifeboats event. And can I, on behalf of everyone at Dunbar Lifeboat Station, please say thank you for all of your continued support for Dunbar RNLI. Last year in Dunbar, we raised around £90,000. Special thank yous this evening go to the lovely Jean Bell. Jean, where are you? Jean, she's hiding somewhere. She's probably in a darkened room. Jean choreographed all of the dances and her husband David, who's also filming, for cutting the music. Louise Gray, for here, for choreographing the entrance dance, the end dance, and supporting all of the dancers during the midweek practices. And last, but by no means least, Katie Pollock, who has made the outfits for the entrance and end dances, and stitched and sequined to within an inch of her life, around 60,000 sequins in total. Can I now introduce Stuart Craig, our MC for this evening, and Louise Gray, our co-host. Thank you very much. Thanks for having me. I'll be taking things along tonight, and uh, Louise will be the road reporter uh, amongst you, get some chat from the family and friends. But, Saturday night, certainly for the life force, is always a noisy night. So, let's go back to 2018 to have last year's winners, Annette and Ian!
Okay, let's get the dancers in. Put your hands together for Satan and Seal tonight. I'm praying now that I have to say tonight this afternoon. Put your hands together for Shakers by the Life Boat Dancers 
that's what I'm going to And one of the committee members will come out and get that piece of paper off you. Make sense? Okay. Okay, the first couple on the floor tonight will be Liz and Brenton. Where's Liz and Brenton's family and friends? Over there, jump on. Okay. Let's give them a big welcome. The first couple this evening. Liz and Brenton dancing an American smooth fox trot. Thank <laughs> you. 
Kelly, second time you've won nine packs. Enjoyed it? Absolutely brilliant. All the friends and family have been great, so I hope it's a good gift to go in. So for you, I am a bit louder than last night. Saturday, it's always like. Okay, let's go to the judges. Wow. Full of energy and sharp. We had good bounce action. Um, feel the heat. Plenty of energy. Lots of baba boo. Well done. And the missing scores.
Look at the next couple for stands this last year. Here's Pat and Paul's family and friends. Everywhere. Okay, put your hands together for Pat and Paul dancing the Argentine Tango. Oh, 
was going to go free. Freeze? You can just leave it looking for me. Oh, I'm here with Lindsay, and the reason I'm here with Lindsay is I had a, a private message this morning from Kenny's daughter with a message that she'd like to give to you, and Lindsay's going to read it out. On, but thanks to Ian, I've been able to watch from entry. You both did amazing. Lindsay, you look absolutely beautiful, and although you are getting on a bit, Dad, <laughs> and you're a wee bit knackered, I am so proud of you. You both absolutely smashed it, and it's a 10 from me. It's a pack of winner. Never two it is, it makes it was one time I've got my toe And I lost it instant. <laughs> okay, judges. Wow, that was so emotional. We really knew I'd be crying. Oh, it was just fantastic. It was for the points that you had together. We just so tender together while you were dancing and you could tell that there was that fantastic connection with you. Just amazing. Honestly, well done. I need to get the two shoes. Oh. Great stuff. And uh, that goes on scores. Eight, 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 eight.
of nine at the very beginning when you were pulling your weight now really trusting you that's really lovely to see good hip action we saw some of that happening and also there was a sultriness that was coming through the piece as you moved right through so well done really good work thank you very good enough some scores Eight, seven, seven, seven! Well done, West Ham Brighton! Okay, the next couple is Elena and Rory. Make some noise because they're going to be dancing. American Smooth. Oh, <laughs> 
they don't know black? And they will be dancing an Argentine tango.
Well done, guys. Can I have your place in the air? Enjoy that book? Yes. <laughs> but are you getting a breath there? No, no, it's ready to get one time. Are you filming the audience? No, you're good. Yeah, let's get the judges. Thanks, man. I won't get your scores to stay for because I forgot to put the family and friends there. Charlie and Louise. I'm behind you. I'm with Carla. Hi. <laughs> um, we're very proud of you. We think you've got absolutely amazing and we also said hi to the world. Okay, can we have some scores, please? Nine, 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 nine! Okay, our next couple dancing a cracking tune. Lindsay and Kenny dancing the cha cha.
we have to say a big thank you to the Monica. We have to say a massive thank you to Jane. There is Miss. Let's say a massive thank you to David, but he is still filming.
Wait, that's when uh, Temple Hill was there. Yes. The feast, that yes. was there. Well, do you want to go around the facing down? Or what you could do is go around facing up. You could change your pelvis that way, with your legs crossed in front. Which might look better than with your push them out and your legs at the back. Do you understand what I mean? I really don't want to write. So you can either... What you can do, hang on, just hang on just a sec. So what you can do is you can think around and you can get the legs around to the back so that your legs are going around to the back. Or if you wanted to, you could kick around and you could be spinning around with your legs forward rather than backwards. Okay. I think it would be your choice. Yeah, the trouble is, if she slips, she's going to dislocate her. I remember which way your hand is. Yes? Do I go? I don't know. Do I go? I don't know. That's cool. We're very close. You just want to turn your pill back. You're going to do this. And then can you stop? Yeah, I just don't drop her down at the end. Drop her slowly because you've got to work out what you're doing. Thank you. 
hands. As you're doing it, so we're cha-cha-charing, yeah? Step across. Now keep your feet on the floor. So turn back to back with me. Keep your feet on the floor. Don't move your feet back. Do you touch that? That's right. Yeah. Cha-cha-cha. Now, put the foot over. This one. No. no. This one. Don't see. Yes. Yeah. Now, keep your feet on the floor. And twizzle them. Amazing. Yeah. And then you can cha-cha this way. Back on it. Forward left. Cha-cha. Right. And left. Go. Right.
So you're facing that way. Okay. So the key is right up here. Right, don't try and travel so much. Yeah. It's, it's, it's traveling too much. Yeah. So do it again. Don't travel so much, and as you're doing it, focus on keep it going, keep it going, rather than.
there. That's forward, side, back. Now you go hand, forward, side, back. And Quentin, you're doing um, back, side, forward.
back then. Would you like that? Got to lift it from the knee. So we've got to separate the thighs. Last time. Yeah. Yeah? That's it. That's better. Is that hard again? No. Right. Okay. How are you feeling there? Okay. You sure? Mm -hmm. Right. Now come down. How are you going? You're going to bring her down? So I need to. <coughs> <laughs> yeah. And then the arms, it slides down. Thank you. 
change your head.